On this first night of many for this tent revival in Burlington, people couldn't get by without filling out a form and having their temperature taken on the way in. Hundreds came out to take part in a tent revival in Burlington to come together during a time of uncertainty. I just wanted to come out and see the crowd and be a part of the body of the of Jesus Christ. We want to pray and repent and say, God, change this nation started with me. Change America started with me. But organizers are still keeping in mind the health and safety of worshipers, temperature checks when you walk in, and a form to fill out with basic information like name and address. We funneled everyone through two okay. lanes to get into the tent. Organizer and Frank lane. Mickens everyone says hand washing stations are set up around the property so and they're giving out masks to anyone who doesn't I'm have so one. At the end of the day, what we want to do is give people the tools to be careful and take precautions. We also have been in touch with the health department. Betty Wilson, who's from Green. Greensboro says she's comfortable with the precautions in place. I think it's wise. You know, you need to have guidelines and stick with those. You know, it's nice to get my temperature taken. <laughs> I've <laughs> um, got my mask, you know. Wilson says she just hopes people can use this as a time to come together. Having a unified feeling in our hearts that we all came together, that we prayed for our country, that we prayed for um, people. The tent revival will be held every Thursday, Friday, and Saturday for the next four weeks right off of I-40. And they're expecting anywhere from 500 to 1,500 people on any given night.